Hello friends, welcome to my channel. In this video, we will see how to model one horizontal vessel with the different uh, attributes, not like this, not like this, uh, with different attributes and different nozzle orientations. And uh, we will model in this video. Also, uh, see, we have to make one floor to keep this all equipment. So I can make one floor by using primitives method okay okay we will go we will start just uh, we have to click here i will make one separate zone here so i will click civil civil enter okay so in this zone we will model all structure civil supports racks everything okay everything under the under uh, this zone okay now i click this zone and go to equipment and create equipment that is floor I will write floor. Enter. I just keep zero. Okay. Everything, all coordination, I just keep zero. And okay. Now I click here and I open command box. Show primitives. Just double click here and enter. And I will go to box. And you see there is X length, Y length, and Z length. So you see here x length, y length, z length. I will make x length as 10,000, y also 10,000, and z as 300. Enter, create. Now it is asking, see, it is created in zero point, okay? So this one we created. Now it looks small so i just make it little bigger okay just click next i can make it big so nothing uh, this one click box go to command q attributes here you see x length y length and z length showing so double click x length and remove this one and put three also y length double click remove this one keep three see now we make it for thirty thousand in this floor we can keep all our structure equipment tanks columns reboilers everything so i will make it just for example this is you know, one small just small plant like that so i can make it this is for sample dummy okay okay friends now Okay, now I want to make one now I want to make one equipment that is that is uh, horizontal vessel so I keep it here just keep here go to this one and click equipment horizontal equipment so what i will do is i just make copy and move and i will make modify how to modify these attributes i will show you that method okay just modifying the equipment only just i click click here i can make copy and again i can paste okay it will come like that copy name of so how you will change this name so uh, you can just right click here just rename remove this copy put vessel one okay just if you want to change only vessel you can make only otherwise if you want to all change all sub equipment also you rename all and apply cancel you see this one okay now already it is copied so i will just move can put it in plan view so i want to move here so i will make by north i want to move 8000 see i have moved it to 8000 okay so now i just click here also
cylinder i want to check the diameter and the length of the cylinder so what is the command is i put q at q at at mesh attributes so you see diameter is 2000 height is 5000 so i make this height height means length i will make this 6000 enter and diameter will be 2500 enter okay so the cylinder is getting bigger now i want to keep this this just put it here i make diameter 2000 i just double click here so you can see it by f11 click f11 you can see in wireframe see it is coming here okay i make it 2500 same so if you want to make this one you have to click this this and the diameter double click here and enter okay now i want to move by using i will go to home move by position so i click here graphics cursor and i just click here and click like this see it is moved here i click apply and cancel same like that here also i click this one this this two this is this two and i make diameter 2500 and i move by position i click here graphics cursor i just click this wireframe cylinder and just make it like this just wait until this box coming okay and apply and also you see nozzle is there click this nozzle just click cancel click this nozzle we'll go here click this nozzle so move by west it is showing this so by west 500 okay now click this nozzle just this one click nozzle by east you can make it here east you can write e or you can make minus here minus 500 see it come here okay now save your work then press f11 see now we have changed the diameter and the length of the vessel okay the diameter of this vessel is 2000 this is 2500 okay now i want to make now i want to make nozzle here upside upside here one nozzle here one nozzle and downside one nozzle okay this is just i am making roughly uh, i am not following any gad's just i am making roughly before that i want to change this uh, i want to change the nozzle bore so what i will do i can make q para and check the dia check the bore it is showing 100 okay so go to equipment here you go modify nozzle you can see it is 100 so i want to make this 150 just click 150 next okay here also i want to make 150 i click this q para it is 100 go to nozzle nozzle it is coming here this one so i make 150 okay okay we have changed this all and save your work now i want to make nozzle here this area this area and down area. so click nozzle click nozzle and i will go to create nozzle and i will write the n3 okay and 150 ANC plans all i make is 150 now i make 150 mm bore click here also i want to make height i will make 200 temperature the pressure no need 
that one you will change later so i click create it is showing the positioning so i want to create i will just click graphics and cursor and i just click here okay now it is coming like that so you can rotate here by using this box just put 90 apply rotation so like that you can apply next now it is not in proper position so i will go to command method by u 100 i make okay by u 100 now <coughs> i make one nozzle here i want to keep it here and also one nozzle here so what i will what i do is i just click here just move by east here you see the direction is east it is showing here east so i will make east thousand again thousand this came here okay save your work now <clears throat> i want to make one more nozzle here here okay so i will just click create nozzle You can make by offset also, but uh, I will show you how to create. Okay, here uh, I'll create N4. Click 150, 150. Height will be 200. And create. I just keep graphics cursor. Just click like this. And uh, rotate. I want to rotate here. Just apply. On the x-axis. now here i can change okay here i will change here i will change east i want to move east okay so i will just click next go common method by east thousand by u hundred just double click and enter now I make two nozzles in same dimension, same bow. So downside I want to make one nozzle. What I will do is I just click nozzle here and go to nozzle. Here I will make N5 nozzle 5. 150. This is also I will make 200. Height will be 200. Create. I want to make downside center of this cylinder. So I click here. I will rotate here. And downside I make 3. 350. Okay. 1350. And here I will click next. Go to command window by west and make 2500. See, it is coming here by west 2500. Don't say that's one nozzle skin. Now, save the work. Now, in this class, in this video, we saw how to make attributes, how to make uh, changes in uh, nozzle, changes in uh, vessels like cylinder dishes how to change the attributes and also how to create nozzles for this uh, vessel right so next class what we will see we will position all this equipment and uh, also i will make one reboiler by using gad also next class i will make one column by using gad also some equipments also some tanks once we make all this one we will start routing piping okay so okay friends if you like this video just click like 
share and subscribe support my channel if you have any doubt please comment in my comment section i will reply for that if i have any mistakes any errors also just tell me i will correct okay okay friends thank you so much